Companion was a somewhat vague term used to describe the doctor's closest friends. Audio. Situation vacant. No place like home, death and the queen. Such people knew the doctor's secret. That they were someone non-human who traveled in time and space in a police box-shaped craft called the TARDIS. The doctor's companions often directly saved the doctor's lives, TV, Rose, the family of blood, or provided the doctor with a perspective that prevented them from abusing their time lord powers. Audio, to the death, TV, school reunion, the runaway bride, the fires of Pompeii. On some occasions, they were the proximate reason that the doctor sacrificed their then current life and regenerated. TV, the caves of Androzani, the parting of the ways, the end of time. On others, they lost their lives in pursuit of the doctor's goals. TV, the traitors, the destruction of time, earth shock, voyage of the damned, face the raven, audio, absolution, to the death. The eleventh doctor told Amy Pond he traveled with companions to see the universe through the eyes of somebody who hadn't experienced it all already. H-O-M-E-V-I-D. Meanwhile in the TARDIS, he also mentioned that he took great care in choosing them. TV, Amy's choice. Once they left the doctor's company, most companions used their newfound perspective of life and morality to help others. Sarah Jane Smith once noted that with them around, the doctor, their ideology and legacy, would never die. TV, Death of the Doctor. Rose Tyler felt she had learned a better way of living life from her time spent with the Ninth Doctor and earned a new resolve to take action, to make a stand when things needed changing. TV, The Parting of the Ways. The companions also helped the Doctor in their battles against evil throughout time and space. TV, The Ultimate Foe. In particular, Ace called the Daleks, the catch, to being a companion, audio, enemy of the Daleks while Clara Oswald described them as a companion's deadliest foe. Pros, the companion's companion. Because the term was a shortening of the expression, traveling companion, most companions did in fact voyage with the doctor in the TARDIS. Depending on the situation, other words were used to describe the same relationship, most frequently, assistant. However, it was unusual to hear the doctor call their friends by either word. Different incarnations had different preferences. The third doctor, perhaps owing to his unique situation of exile, most frequently used the term, assistant. TV, the ambassadors of death, terror of the Ottens, on the other hand, when the eighth doctor was forced to define the word companion, he eschewed the term assistant in favor of friend. Audio, situation vacant. Sarah Jane once implied the doctor's companions served as a surrogate family for them, despite the Time Lord's insistence that they were alone in the universe. TV, Journey's End. Martha Jones even stated the doctor took on companions to ease their loneliness. TV. The Family of Blood. Both terms were occasionally troublesome. Sometimes, the word companion was interpreted sexually, leading to confusion about the doctor's relationship with their friends. TV. Aliens of London. Closing time. Sometimes, companions bickered over the appropriateness of the word assistant. Rose Tyler said emphatically, I'm not his assistant when Sarah Jane Smith called her one. TV, school reunion. Rose seemed happier being called a companion, as when Harriet Jones called out over the subwave network for former companions of the doctor. TV, the stolen earth, another term was associate, which was used primarily by the Daleks. TV, the parting of the ways, the Big Bang, the witch is familiar. The eleventh doctor himself once introduced Clara Oswald to Mother Superior's Tasha Lem as his associate. TV. The time of the doctor. People were companions or assistants to the doctor for varying lengths of time, but most stayed with him for more than one adventure. TV. An unearthly child, the Daleks, the rescue, the Romans, the chase, the time meddler at all. Some stayed for a few days, while others were with them for years. Audio. No place like home, absent friends. On occasion, companions could be separated from the doctor for months or years before they resume traveling with them. TV, the doctor, the widow in the wardrobe, audio, the juggernauts, other time lords, usually renegades, sometimes had traveling companions.